Welcome back to Six Minutes. Do you know, in the questions we asked you for, we got a number of them back, a, a disproportionate number. People wanting to know, how do you get through the blocks? You know, I'm studying the six minutes every day, and I really enjoy it. I, um, I, I'm reading the books that you recommend, and yet it seems like there's something blocking the good coming to me. Well, it's your thought that there's something blocking it. We become what we think about. You've got to quit giving energy to anything blocking. I was having breakfast with a woman one morning not too long ago, a very successful lady by most people's standards, has her own production company for television shows. And she said, you know, everything's going pretty good. But she said, we're having a financial problem. It just seems like the money is blocked. It's not coming. I said, well, quit saying that. Her quick response was, but how would I explain it to you if I quit saying it? See, I meant let it go. Don't give it any energy. Stop looking at blocks. Stop thinking anything's blocking you. I want you to sit down and rather giving any energy to blocks, look at the good coming to you. Do what Price Pritchett said. He said the absence of evidence is not evidence of absence. Just because you can't see the good coming, that doesn't mean it's not coming. I want you to mentally start seeing the things happening. If you need prospects, see them coming. If you need somebody new for your company, see that happening. If it's money you need, see the money coming. And feel it. You've got to let yourself feel it. Get your thoughts, your feelings, and actions in sync with it. Take four or five minutes right now. And focus on what you want coming. Don't give any thought to blocks. There are no blocks. Let them go. There are illusions that you're creating. Let them go. See the good you want and actually visualize it coming. And start to feel good because it's coming. That's the way it'll work. Spend four or five minutes doing that right now.